hey guys welcome back again to my channel my name is vicky and i'm making this video from lagos nigeria please if you're seeing my face for the very first time please consider to hit on the red subscribe button and subscribe to my channel and do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that you'll be informed whenever i post a new video and please give this video a thumbs up leave me a comment down below don't mind my scaffold because i'm already preparing to actually go to church all right guys like yesterday night party was just lit 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 like the housemate had an old one bed team kind of um, party you get and then they gave them some do i call it dollar bill or bb ninja bill because yeah they had some prints which they sprayed on themselves with their images on it and all of them their clothes were looking dapper especially the male housemates like all of them the likes of new the likes of kid wire the likes of our lord bellish bright toe all of them they are like praise all of them their clothes were really 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 looking good and then dorothy's clothes was awesome like nengi's clothes was fire like seriously they had actually had their fun and then you need to see lucy on the dance floor you guys would think that lucy is dancing because she's feeling like she's going to give today because we have not seen that part that dancing skill of lucy ever ever in the house you get she actually was dancing as if there was no tomorrow like she was dancing like if i go i go if i die i die kind of a thing you get she really had crazy fun and then keisha was something else she really really enjoyed herself and then let me go talk about the keisha matter new was really really rocking keisha in the dance floor on dance floor and i'm like what's going on here because for some reason throughout the day and then a day before we have been noticing some moves with new and Kaisha and I'm, I don't understand what has been happening there. Me, I've been suspicious of them, you get, because at some point their ship, the V and new ship has been slowed down because of this Kaisha thing, because I remember a day he was having a conversation with Kidwire and he was saying he actually remembered the clothes that um, Kaisha wore when he wore, when she was coming into the house, as in the very first day they came in. And then Kid was like, did you remember this? And he was like, no, that he did not remember um, um, this on. And then um, Kidwire was like, don't even let V hear this one because there's going to be a problem, you understand? There's been some sort of chemistry. I think he was leaning towards Kaisha at the beginning of the show, but you know how it is now, this whole thing, if you don't shoot your shot, someone else shot, will shoot her shot, you know, and then V came, shot her shot, and they were together now. And then for some reason, they have just been changing the game plan for us all, like surprisingly, because yesterday when um, Kaisha and Nengi actually had that fight, it was just new trying to hold kaisha hugging her carrying her you get that kind of thing so they were most definitely like you will see him the affection here even after the party after they have finished dancing before i even go please which music would they ever play for kid wire to be able to dance anyway billionaires don't know how to dance by the way <laughs> so kid wire is cannot dance to save his life at this very point kid wire is so bad at dancing but so he's still cute though so let's let's excuse him for that if he doesn't know how to dance he's got the cash to dance for him <laughs> so that's just it and then when they came back from the party after the whole groove and the whole enjoyment they had at the party v was just carrying her face that's because kid ym new has been rocking kaisha or i feel that she has started suspecting or she has started seeing the moves and then she wasn't happy about it v was just carrying her face throughout in the kitchen and just feeling somehow not really happy you get and then wh while they were doing this thing watoni was in the kitchen and then Chris came to whisper into watoni's ears that she should go and check what's going on in the room your day car your day who is most definitely going to suffer for 600 years has refused to be showing us legit things that has been going on in that room watoni actually ran into the room and came back smiling and was like they were giving themselves sign smile because brighto even followed up you get and i, I was even expecting kayode to actually follow them let's go and see what's going on there but no Kayode did not agree to do that for us, you get. So, Nyo came out smiling from ear to ear, being very excited, came and made noodles. And V was even in the kitchen, made noodles for himself and Keisha, and they were eating. And to be to be sincere, and to be honest, being the appropriate than I am, I just hope that Kaisha doesn't leave today because this drama, I'm in for it. Like, I really want to see how it's going to end. If it's going to end in plenty premium tears, or it's going to end in, well, more drama, because basically, because I'm sure... V will not have it with Kaisha if she if she's sure of what she's actually suspecting, you get. And then Nengi was speaking to us, telling us all that 
she actually has settled her beef with everybody she doesn't want to be seen in such bad light or she doesn't want to be perceived like that anymore she has she has maybe had a talk with kaisha maybe in the party because we did not see that part we only heard her telling us and also was just confessing love to 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 nengi that uh, he will love her forever and ever nothing will ever change his mind that uh, if uh, nengi should go today he's going to feel really bad nengi was like if other is going today that she's really going to cry him a river and i'm like hey these people, their ship is just sharp, going slow and steady, even though Nengi has actually brother zoned also. But I think that they are taking it one step at a time, being friends for the like first before taking it too fast, you get. And then that was just the conversation that went after the party. So, to the main gist of today, Kayo did just took the camera for us to go and see some aggressive cuddling according to katrina katrina said it is aggressive cuddling what she and praise actually did under the duvet was aggressive cuddling that nothing actually happened so coyote actually gave us like few seconds to actually see how kidwire and erica were doing the aggressive cuddling let me leave you guys to see that for yourself Did you guys see what Kayode actually did? Kayode actually showed us a few seconds and then removed the camera like you guys should go and watch it on show max because I'm sure that's where it would be. They refuse to actually show us what it really is, like show us what they have been up to, but they will just give us a piece of it you get. And what did you guys see? Is it aggressive cuddling? But the professionals or people that are into this thing very well told us that something was going on under that duvet. You understand? Something has been happening, you get. And the way that, you know, because last week i remembered um erica was telling Lipon to actually bodyguard her don't allow her do this so only for her to just allow this to happen just a week later when Lipon didn't have her back anymore or wasn't didn't care anymore because at the party Lipon was really really shoving erica like you need to see how like the social distancing was top notch from the angle of Lekon. Lekon did not even care whether Erica was there. If Erica comes close, he just moves away. That's that is it. His so social distancing to Erica was 101, like so on point. He did not want to be caught on, on fresh. He did not want to be caught off guard. Maybe you seeing her seeing him with Erica and then feeling something. He did not dance with Erica. He stayed right away from Erica. And then just coming back, I'm sure that Eric, you know, Erica is always wanting to eat kid wire up he, he, like she can't even sit on her own like that's how it is whenever she's around kid wire either she's sitting on his lap or she's standing by his side or the, like like you can't had you can hardly see her standing on her own so what actually happened is what i'm sure has maybe been happening and kayode has been refusing to show us but this one he just said he should give us a tip of the iceberg then we can go watch it on show max because maybe i'm sure it might be on show max but at this very point i am I don't know if I should say disappointed or I'm excited because it's giving me the content I actually paid for. But Kyle has just been so unfair with the way he has been handling this whole camera of a team. I think Biggie needs to change him or is it Biggie's plan to actually be making Kyle tease us with all this thing. Anyway guys, that's what actually happened. I'm sorry about the noise you're actually hearing. The Bibi Ninja house has just been interesting by the day. You get what I'm trying to say. And then we just hope that we don't know who is going to actually leave today because today is eviction night. And we are just hoping, yeah, I just hope that Ka Keisha, even at this point, even though I, I feel that she might leave, you get but i just hope that kaisha doesn't leave because i'm in for the drama that is about to happen in the house because v will not be taking it so what did you guys see in that video is it what i'm thinking that you're thinking and what are you thinking about this new and v and kaisha situation like the triangle that is about to happen among the three of them or that's already happening it is already happening my my people it is already happened please leave it in the comment section i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up Leave me a comment down below what your thoughts are. I would love to hear from you. And if you have not subscribed to the channel, do it to hit on the red subscribe button and subscribe to the channel. Turn on your notification so that you'll be informed whenever I post a new video. Take care of yourself and happy Sunday. I'll definitely see you guys in my next video.